Alright, hello everybody. I'm gonna actually show you how to um, install a Baldi Bepinex mod, yes. Um, it shouldn't be that hard, but I know it can be challenging for a few people. So I'm just going to quickly explain it real quick in this uh, tutorial. Because I have seen a lot of people like struggling and all that. So, um, first you're gonna want to go to the link in the description. And you're gonna want to go here. Do not, if you're not a Linux user or whatever this is for, I can't really remember, but I think that's Linux. You 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 do not want to download this if you do not use Linux. Uh, you want to download this uh, either these two. Uh, the X and then the number is dependent on your Windows version. Uh, so just download the one according to that. I use 64, so I'm gonna download that. Then once it's done downloading. You can uh, open it, and then all you have to do is uh, all you have to do is uh, just select all of these, all of these, yes, and then drag them into your Baldi Plus folder. Do not touch anything in here yet. Just drag them into here, and uh, I've already got a little bit of it installed right now, but so I can just replace that. But um, okay. You do not need to touch anything, even after dragging it in. All you need to do is uh, is open the game. Wait for it to open. Come on. And, uh, and then, I'm just going to wait for it to load a little more. And then, you can just Alt F4 out of it. And then, everything should be in here now. In the Bepinex folder, right here. So that is it. You have basically installed Bepinex, and uh, just to show it works real quick, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna install uh, the level editor mod. I'm just gonna drag all the DLLs. Now, just a note: some modders will usually have it like this, where it shows where it should be. So when it's Bepinex plugins, you just want to use the same folder order. Okay, just go. Weapon X, then drag all these DLLs that are in the plugins folder in the zip. Uh, drag them into the plugins folder in your Weapon X copy. As you can see right here, yep, that is good. And then some mods, um, they also use streaming assets, which is pretty easy to. Uh, so you just want to go into the zip, and then after streaming assets, you, all you want to do is go to your copy of the game and go to Baldi underscore data and then streaming assets and then you can drag whatever is in there into the streaming assets folder and then you should be good. Uh, I hope this tutorial cleared up things for y'all because I've seen a lot of y'all struggling uh, especially in Ben's Discord server and bothering him. So uh, take this, Ben, as your little uh, video so that people stop pinging you on Discord. But uh, that's besides the point. Um, enjoy, y'all. Uh, have fun modding and playing mods.